Dexter and Mar, um, so they'll know what they're doing for the day. They'll then start loading up wheelbarrows with uh, tools and or you'll help them load up the wheelbarrows with tools. So I just grabbed a few for instance. Um, a rock rake, which you, you would use to spread rock. A scoop shovel that I would use to scoop rock or dirt. Um, and then a spade. A spade is used that we usually do for digging. Um, and then a broom, obviously, to sweep up. Um, so when we're putting this into the truck, we want to make sure we keep it organized, as well as we don't want to break and snap anything. Um, if we would just throw this all in the truck and then throw the wheelbarrows on top, it would snap the brooms or the rakes. So what we'll do with any long item, um, such as brooms and rakes, you'll put them horizontal up at the front of the uh, truck. You'll sit them this way. item you'll put it vertically in the back of the truck and typically try to stack them as neat as you can and as close to the side as you can because then we'll be having saws and whatnot in the middle um, and those are a little more bulkier okay and then you, when you have everything loaded you'll throw your wheelbarrows on top so the wheelbarrows are always the last thing that you'll load when you're loading up your truck okay so the easiest way to load a wheelbarrow is to get the bucket towards you and then lean it up against you so you can grasp. All right, then you're gonna hip thrust. Oh. Set it on top. And it'll just slide right in. And it's okay, the handlebars can sit like this because essentially you'll have a full truck um, and you'll have everything nice and, nice and tight.